morning ZCC family, it's your boy Zaddy Chuck Chuck. We are back again with another video for you guys today. And it's not your typical mukbang today, it's a cooking challenge! I'm super excited today because everybody in this house says they are great cooks. And I want to see what they're about. But we're going to do it with a twist. We're going to create teams, even Tri-City is going to be a part of this. And we're going to see who can make the best dish for my taste buds. Now, I'm going to be the judge. And these are going to be the cooks. We already know what time it is for the company, baby. The party fan, baby. Yeah. <laughs> let's go, let's go. So pretty much the rules is I'm going to uh, pick uh, teams out of a hat. And then I'm going to shuffle it up, pick teams. It's going to be two on two. We're going to go to the grocery store. And they're going to buy whatever they need to buy to make me the best dish possible. I'm really excited. I'm really going to try not to be biased at all. Well, not try. I'm not going to be biased at all. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and pick it. So Snoop wait, Snoop made uh, names out of uh, uh, swipes. <laughs> so, let me get a hat. Can I get a hat? Oh, yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man, I ain't got a haircut. Okay, who can break me up? All right. My fault. All right. First person I'm choosing. Try City. <laughs> Yeah, build up the excitement. Uh, no. Wait a second. So, <coughs> so Tri City's team one, this is team two. So you put the next person. So we have more draws. So the first person for the other team is. James! Ooh. Yeah, the same team, okay. You <laughs> okay. Yeah, we might as well start over. This is Tri's partner. They acting like I don't cook. <laughs> Tri City partner is. Snoop Dogg! Yeah. So I'm super excited. We see the teams. It's Try and Snoop versus James and Rob. Cause we're brothers, right? We're brothers. <laughs> we're happy. <laughs> so you guys decided? Yeah. Who's gonna make the best dish in the house? Yeah. Yeah. You already know what time it is. <laughs> so the objective is just to make one meal, your best meal. Show what you got. Show me all your skills. And then, um, honestly. I really kind of want to do like a blindfold taste test, but then I'm, I mean, that means I couldn't watch you guys cook then, you know? So, we'll see how this goes. All right, CCC family, I'm really excited. The homies are about to cook up a great dish. I believe in both teams. Um, James and Rob, they're great cooks. You know, they, they like to experiment. Uh, I believe, I have an idea that their choice is gonna be a little bit more healthier. Uh, James and Snoop though, I feel like they're gonna bring me that flavor. They're gonna bring me that, uh, you know, something that I think I'll enjoy, enjoy more, which is actually the key, ZCC family, because you gotta think about it. I am the taste tester, so you wanna make something that you know the judge is gonna like. So let's see if they take that into accountability into play. Um, obviously, I would like for you guys to judge too in the comment section. You can't taste, but judge just by looks. I'm not gonna be biased at all. I'm gonna put whatever team I think is the best, it's gonna be the best. But um, what I am gonna try to do is get another taste test around here. I'm calling my old editor, Rashad. I'm gonna see if he can come slide through just so we can have a super unbiased opinion. Like I said, I'm truly not gonna be biased, but I just want someone who just does not know. But uh, see if you can come in. If not, I'll do it myself and I'm gonna be 100% fair. I'm excited, my taste buds ready. ZCC family, if you guys are ready, let's get it. Okay, so we got, <laughs> we got uh, I think, so we're working for y'all budget. Yeah, right. Um, you can cook pretty much anything. So mm -hmm. you can cook like a main thing and put a dessert on there. I heard Stu earlier yesterday talking about some chimichurri sauce. So yeah, I think maybe we could do that, but mm -hmm. maybe just let them take that course. Yeah. Um, because you know, if we took like, a, I mean, I was already thinking about obviously, like, if you really want to present a some stuff, you know, Chunk is going to love, like, make a crazy steak. And I know, like, yeah. we can marinate, like, the teriyaki. It's the thing is, it takes a lot. We got the teriyaki steak, we got to marinate that at least a full day. Yes. Yeah. But then if we made it on chimichurri, but we don't have a blender. But, like, I mean, if we had chocolate steak, meat is rare, chimichurri on it. Um, we could also. 
also made that uh, smoked salmon uh, bagels. Yeah. Those are fire. I think everybody would like those. Plus, I would love the leftovers. <laughs> okay. um, but uh, how, do you, how do you feel going into this? So, like, I like the idea. Well, I think we should win. Yeah, so, yeah we for sure should win. Um, I think, I was telling you before, I think uh, cooking is a lot like love making. You know, some people just want to rush it, but we want to take our time, make it presentable. Uh, <laughs> I was uh, speaking of buttering it up. So, like, Hawaiian, King's Hawaiian rolls. Yeah. Um, so, I was thinking, like, dude, what if we can do, like, if we can buy King's Hawaiian rolls in the store, we can make, like, three different types of sliders. Yeah. Or something. Like, we could do, like, uh, like, what if we're doing chicken jerk steak slime? A little burger slime. And then we'll yeah, dessert yeah, slime. Yeah. Yeah. Make like a little blueberry jam. With a little like, Nutella or something. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like a dessert one, two regular ones, like or two savory ones, and a dessert one. Yeah, I mess with that. Like, because seriously, you could just get like some stuff. You need like some skirt steak too and marinate it in something that could be one of the sliders. That'd oh, be super great. Drop cool. some lemon zest on the blueberry, like blueberry lemon zest. Yeah. Pink pink butter, jelly. Well, we should we try. Yeah. So, okay, what do you think about sliders? I'm down. I okay, like okay, so, okay, okay, okay. So we just have to find yeah. King's Hawaii rolls. If mm-hmm. we don't find those, then I think they've, I think we've seen them. Now, okay. as long as we, I know if we go to head, I know a lot of people H-E-B. want to go to head. AGB, right? <laughs> All the Texas people are like, it's not head. Um, <laughs> hey, that's facts. I can stay getting called out. I mean, like, I'm not Texas, I guess. But yeah. we out here. Um, so we're pretty much set. Yeah, we're set, man. Okay, wait. So, so the sliders. Yeah. I'm gonna do the chimichurri steak. Uh, chimichurri, see, this chimichurri sauce is just going to be because we want to make it from scratch. Yeah, yeah. I just feel like that's going to be a lot. No, but it'd be nice if we made some leftovers so we have it for later. Today. Yeah, I mean, because I think that's going to be great to stay for later, so you had some for yourself for dinner. Okay. That would be a fire move. And then I have a little bit of ground beef already. Mm-hmm. So if you want to do like one real slider, mm-hmm. you can make like one avocado with guacamole. Oh, yeah. this is like. Uh, yeah, we're about to look at Okay, okay, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Peace. I'm so glad to cook off me, Tristan, on teams. No, man. My name's Tri City. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, we got this cook off, and we're excited. I wonder what we're going to do. Yeah, so, alright, so what's the challenge we're going for? Flavor. I think, yeah, I think you were saying that we're going to try to get, like, we're going to try to outdo it with the flavor because, you know, they're probably going to get us with the style and presentation. Yeah. And they may do some healthy stuff. You yeah. Know, Chunk don't like healthy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Based on, um, based on, you know, James's culinary skills and they're probably going to try to whip up something. Probably going to decorate it. Um, we're going to take the other route and go for flavor. Mm-hmm. Um, based yeah. on what Chunk likes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, he likes chicken. He likes how I make chicken. So I think I'm going to go with this, uh, make some fried gym sticks. You feel me? And uh, we got some other little things we're going to do. Some jalapenos. We're going to do the jalapenos. Yeah. Do the jalapenos. Mm-hmm. Um, some chives and then found this recipe for uh, dessert. Yeah, so I think it should be all dope. And then this one seemed like uh, the TikTok with some hot cheetos, and he likes hot cheeto puffs, so we're gonna get a little creative, yeah. take a little risk. Hopefully it works. Yeah, I figured Trump likes the spicy stuff. He's always going on about the spicy, so we'll see how that does. Yeah, so wish us luck. See y'all in a bit. Team beer game. Chef Boy, I'm Chef Boy, I'm here. Chef Boy, I'm here. All right, you guys, so I got the team here. Let's go. I'm really yeah. excited. We are currently at HEB. So, uh, you guys are about to cook a dish, and I'm gonna see whose dish tastes the best. But, there's a twist. So, the twist is, you guys only have 10 minutes to grab all your ingredients oh. that you need to make okay. the hey, perfect that's crazy. dish. That is, that, that's that's crazy. Crazy. 10 minutes. That is the reason why I had you guys bring your GoPros. Because I want you guys to record your 10 minute process to get through HEB. Are you guys ready? Yes. Are you guys excited? Yes. So I got team, what's your team's name? Chef Boyard Beard over here. <laughs> Chef Boyard Beards. And then I also have? We got Rush Hour. The Rush Hours. Okay, okay. I'm really excited. So I'm gonna start the timer and then we're gonna get this popping. You guys ready? Three, two, one, record, it's gone, it's gone, go, go, go! Hey, most important part, King's Hawaiian Rolls, aisle four, baby. Had to give him a little head start just to be fair. No, we just messed with him. <laughs> aisle four? Aisle four is this way. Perfect, thank you. Yeah, thank you, thank you. There they are. Side. 
Yeah. We'll go to the bakery. I feel like they're in the bakery. Hey, what do you, we gotta come back. Uh, pineapple right away. Pineapple? Or we're gonna crush pineapple for the dessert, unless we find like a can. Okay. Um, I think that would be easier if we find a can. We will be over here. Nana's? Oh, you found one that you're gonna make? Yeah. All right. Bananas. Let me see. Oh, bananas. How many we need? <laughs> Just get one of them? Yeah, yeah. Got bananas. Find some blueberries. Okay. One lemon. Got the lemon. We only need one. I know. Let's go. Woo. Most important part right there. Yes, sir. All right, we are on track, baby. We are on track, baby. Bell peppers? Are we doing these still? We're doing jalapeno. 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 Okay. Excuse me. Uh, some chives. 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 Where can we find chives? Great chives. Excuse me, sir. Where can we find peppers at? That, that's cool. Uh, man, man, let's go get the. Uh, making Look at the losers! <laughs> Alright, I got James and Rob. They are on the go. We're looking at about four minutes left, you guys. Four minutes left. Like a chimichurri gouda would be fire. Let's do one portobello mushroom slider. Yeah. This, this, is, this is a hot take on the spot. Let me see. We can work with this one. Um, you know they also have they, they also have these caps right here. Let's do this. Oh, perfect. All right, let me see what's next on the list here. We need we need parsley. Parsley's right there. We just got the four minute warning. Bag it up, bag it up. Yeah. Let's grab this one. Excuse us. Uh, 1460 though. Yeah. Oh, you got that? Oh, perfect. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's all we need. Uh, let's get this one right here. Chicken. Chicken, chicken, chicken. Where's the chicken? Chicken onions. So we're going to do the drumsticks? No, that's the small one. Uh, or the, uh, like the wings, like uh, like the party wings. Yeah, I thought that's what you wanted. Or grab whatever. Nah, cause see, I made the big wings last time. I don't even see them. I think drumsticks will be like easier to roll in that sauce. Oh, that's yeah. why. Here goes something. For a big old thing of chicken. This may be a lot. We're probably not gonna use all of it, but we got some bacon. Oh yeah, get some bacon. Sweet. Mm -hmm. Damn bacon. So, what else? Oh, cream cheese. Mm -hmm. That's gonna be in the dairy. We need cream cheese. We need some, uh, probably some Cool Whip or something. Ooh, hot Cheeto puffs. We gotta get the hot Cheeto puffs. Um, oh, and I gotta get oil. We don't have any oil. Okay. All right, and pepper. Okay. Right. Good. This. Oh, cool. Cream cheese. Get a small one. Got the cream cheese. All right. So next thing on our list, we created together. Um, blueberries, lemon, powdered oh, sugar, yeah. mint. So mint is going to be, right, I feel like mint is right here. Yes sir, we got us some mint. We got a little smaller thing. So we got a lemon, we got blueberries, powdered sugar, mini powdered sugar. I'm going to get me some raspberries because we're going to be under. Right. That's perfect. There All we right. go. The guy just told us to stop the filming. Last thing we need, some powdered sugar and we should be set. Hey, oh, we, we doing some, you know we, need to? we got some, uh, we're gonna put some uh, pepper, pepper jack, jack down there too. Oh, we should get a jalapeno. Bro, dude, chunk likes jalapenos. Yeah, yeah. So let's grab one more serrano before we... We gotta get sugar. We gotta go. We gotta okay. eat them. Okay, okay. What do we need from here? Powdered sugar. What does uh, it like, powdered sugar? Yeah, but we're also gonna get dried parsley. Okay. You, don't, you don't have a small one? Uh, I mean, it's 154. Yeah. That's fine. Ooh. Last thing, we gotta get we gotta get one serrano, serrano chili and we'll be good. The smell. Sweet condensed smell. Got it. So, we got all our stuff. How you feeling, Snoop? Feeling good. Time is up. In 
they are. There they are. The time is up. You guys are only a couple seconds left. I'm really excited, man. My stomach growling. I'm ready to get in. So I did forget something. I forgot the cherry pie filling. I think we may be able to improvise because I've seen some pop tarts in there. Maybe we can crush them up. We got, we got a pretty nice looking setup here. I must say. Yeah, I'm excited. Oh. This is about to be amazing. Yeah. Like we're supposed to be cooking just for chunk, but I might have to a little nibble. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. So we got uh, some flank steak. We got some uh, ground beef. Um, we got some pepper jack cheese. We got some parsley, cilantro. Most important thing of the day, yeah. these are white rolls. Y'all know how those is, those slap. But today that's gonna be a staple for what we're making. It's gonna be real delicious. And then we get on to, well, we got portobellos for this stuff. And then olive oil, and then on to the dessert stuff. We got. Oh yeah, it's just some powdered sugar. We got some mint here. Um, you know, and that's pretty much caps it up. We got some lemons lime. and limes. Um, I'm excited. We even got a little chili. What are we about to make? I feel like this is like such a crazy mix of food right now. It's not clear what we about to do. Chuck, what do you think? What, <laughs> I have no clue, but I'm really excited. Y'all got the sweet and the spicy. Yeah, right. Sweet, spicy, and everything nice. So you guys want to explain your dishes that uh, your ingredients that you guys have? Don't tell me what you're making. Just give me the ingredients. <laughs> Damn. We you want to just like not even do the dessert? Well, we might as well and see. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, we have a. All right, for sure. So yeah, we got some hot Cheeto puffs, mm -hmm. some drumsticks, chicken drumsticks. We got some bacon, chives, uh, chives, some jalapeno peppers for some pretty dope. Cream cheese, Philadelphia. Cayenne pepper, cause you gotta have a good kick. Yeah, so you don't just chunk like spice. Pineapple. Pineapples and sweetened mm -hmm. condensed milk for our desserts. Eggs, flour, oil. And these are some more pineapples. And we are going to have a secret guest of strawberry pop tarts. Let's see how this turns out. We didn't miss uh, the ingredients. Because um, we thought we were making something. So I yeah, thought we were making we something, making something different. different. We looked yeah, up the wrong the recipe yeah. for what, what, yeah. what we saw so versus good. what we have. So <laughs> we're going to make the best. So out yeah, we're going to try it. Hopefully you like it. So let's get it. DCC family, we got team Chef Boyar Beard and team Brush Hour. You guys ready? We're about to put 45 minutes on the clock, as you guys can see. In five, four, three, two, one, go! Right now I'm working on the portobellos. I'm gonna handle this steak, I'm gonna handle this beef. I'm getting my flour ready. Yeah, we can do that. I know you're able to change that and stay chilled. That's really good. Hey, can you get like a little thing, a dish, so I can put crackers in the drizzle? We gotta get the olive oil mixed into this sauce. That's how you get pepper, boy. You're done with the knife? Yeah. Nah. And then getting ready for these uh, right. these sliders, some roll joints, <laughs> you got to see, Timmy Terry sauce. So how you looked it up, you looked it up. I was watching that Chappelle show, uh, that Chappelle stand up today and getting all the little kinks out. <laughs> yeah. So I think, uh, make sure that's finally grounded up. And then after that, this oil is almost done. And then I guess you can start on the peppers. So, you know, only way to make real chicken is to put it in there and you gotta shake it up. It's real good. How long you shake it? So your ancestors oh, yeah, tell yeah. you to stop. Make me an egg. Wash. Get egg wash. Who taught you how to cook fried chicken? My mama. Wow, oh, she did. Mm -hmm. Mama. Hey, so and she taught you well too, didn't she? She definitely did. That was good. <laughs> mama. Oh, and he did it in a flavor. Flavin' hot. Not on Mama City. Yeah. Uh, we're working on the sliders. Okay. We've got to make them real small so they fit on okay. the uh, buns. And we're going to take them on a journey with what we're doing though. Yeah, check okay. this out. We got the blueberries going on the flame. We'll get the flame going a little oh, bit decent, snapped. just to get them started. <laughs> we got the chives and the cream cheese. Mm. Oh. Nice oh. this, this is like some homemade uh, dip for the chips. The sour cream onion dip. <laughs> <laughs> so we got yeah. this chicken in here. Woo! This is coming good. I think so. This is coming good. 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 This is Okay, that's what I thought. Woo! We out here. Alright, 
So are those jalapeno yeah. peppers or are they bell peppers? Jalapeno. Ooh. Hey, what, uh, I like I the, the seasoning of choice. Yes, sir. Me too. All right, CC's family, they're going crazy in the kitchen. I'm not gonna lie. I can tell this is about to be a tough one because both of their ingredients are looking great and both of the smells are smelling fantastic. So we about to take some of their raspberries. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. Make a little syrup. Yeah, we can do like individual things. Oh, yeah. oh shit. You almost burnt it again! I really don't the individual video. Got our dessert in the freezer, kind of hoping to see if it harden up a little bit and see how that goes. So we are basically done. We got to try um, doing our presentation. Only thing I was thinking is we could have went like a little fancier on our dish. Like some yeah. salmon rosemary or something. We could do something crazy like that. But it's all good. <laughs> the tops look great, but the bottom, they got a little burnt. Gotta redo it. How much time we got, Chuck? You guys? You're only working with nine minutes Pop and 40 seconds. Got these jalapeno poppers. poppers. Got uh, chives in the cream cheese, and then it's just wrapped around. Should be pretty good. It's yeah. not gonna be too tough okay. to bite through. There, we got just add the chimichurri sauce here, guys. We wanted to take you on a journey. We'll kind of explain it to you as you eat. There we go, it's coming together. Go. All right, so this is, this is the last slider <laughs> and the one that I'm most excited about. Look at that. It's still steamy. Oh, yeah. ZCC family, we are looking at one minute. One minute. Oh! One minute. We're doing our last little, our dessert. A little garnish, garnish. Mm, some bananas in there. One minute. Once this gets no, down to zero, I'm 15 seconds. Let's go. We done? 13, oh. 12, 11, 10, 10 9, 9, 8, 8 7, 7, 6, Five, oh. four, oh, three, two, one. Hands in the air, hands in the air, hands in the air. Woo! Please, won't you wait, won't you stay, at least down to the sun. All right, you guys, so I have Rush Hour 3's dish. Can you guys tell me what's going on here? All right, so we actually kind of want to um, take you on a little journey. So in the beginning, we're just going to start with like our basis, like the normal homegrown cheeseburger with some sautéed onions on it. Next, we kind of wanted to go like a little upper scale, you know, really like uh, appeal to your taste buds with like a, a steak sandwich with chimichurri. Uh, chimichurri sauce on it. And then I'll let my man James take over from here. And then, so from there, we're thinking, all right, we're taking you on this journey. Next is all the vegan wave that's going on right now. So we got a portobello mushroom burger with pepper jack cheese. We got sauteed onions there with the uh, chipotle mayonnaise that we threw on there. And then at the end, we wanted to bring it all home because what do you want to do at the end of the day? You want to connect to your, the child inside of you. So we made a peanut butter and jelly um, slider. Uh, it's got this blueberry jam with uh, lemon, a little bit of... Uh, Sugar. I mean, just just try. You'll like it. It's got a mint garden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, should yeah. I go in the order that you guys presented it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, right. yeah. I'll go Let's ahead. go ahead. Yeah. All right, the homemade burger, the old, the old fashioned Good old classic. Fashion. Yes, sir. We'll get some hot sauce out for the chicken, like some sriracha. Or mm. No cap. Great flavor. Yes. The onion set this off. That's what we want. That's it, all right. That's real good. That's real good. Some cherry steak. Sliders. Mm. Put some lemon in this. Yes, sir. Mm. Let me try some the sweetness of it. Let me swallow a spoon. <laughs> <laughs> this one is not meat. It just has a portobello mushroom. You like mushrooms? Not the biggest fan. Ah. Okay. So if you like this, that's a really good sign. This is cooked like meat, though. You got pepper jack cheese. Let us know. You might turn vegan. Look at him. He's thinking about it. He's like, oh. <laughs> It's just like a burger that mayo and sriracha set it off. Mm -hmm. That's what made it come together better. All right, take a sip of water yeah, before you do that. Water. Cleanse that Cleanse off. That palate. Yes, yeah. sir. Oh, now that we said a sip now. Ginger. We said a sip. Guys, <laughs> 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 I'm thirsty. All right, now for the dessert. PB and J. Ooh. 
when you buy the tool and the blueberries pop, the blueberries will burst in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> well, though, your reaction, Delicious? You, you messed with that? Yeah, it's yeah, yeah. 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 definitely tastes for real like a uh, PB and J, but just more desserty feel to it. This is definitely pretty great. I'm gonna say my reviews for after the uh, Chef Boyard beards. All right, so we went a different route. Um, we only have one judge, and that was Trunk, and we know he likes spice, so we thought we'd kick it up a little bit. Um, do love what they did. That was uh, really nice. Um, but we were decided to cater to just the spice kind of kick. So what we have here is a jalapeno popper. Um, it's uh, cream cheese. It's got chives in it, and then it's wrapped in bacon. Um, put it in the oven for a little bit, and then we have our dessert dish, which we bossed a little bit. Still, um, still could be pretty good. Uh, yeah. We worked with what we had, and then improvised. And then right here, you know, Chunk likes my chicken, so I made some fried chicken. And then we got a little creative with it. It's my first time making it with uh, hot Cheeto puffs. So we put a little hot Cheeto puffs in there because Chunk likes hot Cheeto puffs. A little cayenne pepper for the kick. And then we got some sriracha sauce in case he wants to make it even more spicy for the thing. And then, yeah, so... Did y'all make that sriracha sauce? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Cheat. So, <laughs> the fact that you tried something that you never did before that was bold because yeah. this is it. This is a competition. Yeah. So you went on a limb. All right. So what should I try first? You guys have any recommendations? Nobody go around go like this. Poppers, because this, okay. this has more complexity to it. I haven't All tried right. it yet. <laughs> He's selling that. Yeah. <laughs> the poppers. Oh, complexity. Very nice. <laughs> Y'all did snap though. That looks delicious. Oh, good. Ooh. Ooh. Still, skin still coming out of that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's gonna get hot. <laughs> <laughs> you know, right? Check this uh, sugar. Mm, see how it's still mm. juicy? Mm. Mm. Okay. How, the, how, how, does, how does the flavor and the spices taste on there? Do you, you feel a little cayenne at the end? A little bit? Oh, yeah, yeah, I feel a little spice. I didn't want to go too hard with the yeah. spices, but because I didn't want to overdo it. He's like, when you plant that thought in my mind, you gotta taste it down. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna taste this. Mm -hmm. I think this dessert is about to be killer. This is? Yeah, that looks Dude, good. I just grabbed a uh, piece of banana with the cream, and that was just good oh, by yeah. itself. Ooh. Let's we'll see. Mmm. Oh, he had to go for it's another bite. Let's see what's deeper in there. Mm -hmm. How's the pop tart? We didn't even try it. I think it's pop tart. Actually, it tastes like banana fruity pie. Mm -hmm. and a fruity pie. Yeah, that's what we're going for. Kind of a mixture of a now. <laughs> <laughs> ZCC family, not going to lie, this is a tough decision. I want to congratulate both teams. You guys both did a very good job on it. I'm very proud of you guys. Let's go. Um, let me say some things about each dish. I love that you guys took me on a journey all right here. Very creative, a lot of different flavors. I, I tasted a lot of different things going on. When it comes to this dish, I love that you guys considered my what I liked. You guys thought about, hey, that one I know likes chicken, because obviously this is a good competition, and this is not, uh, this is a, for the judge. Make sure the judge likes it. I love the flame hot Cheeto idea. I like that you guys went out on a limb and I love the jalapeno poppers. The dessert was fantastic too. So, this is good. This is gonna be hard, but I, I have my winner. The winner of the 2021 cook-off competition is... But I have to give it to James and Rob. Tries the soup dessert was better, and these jalapenos I love too. It's just I feel like the flame hot Cheetos uh, took away from the flavor a little bit of the actual chicken. Mm. Like when you first made the chicken, it snapped. Like that was amazing. Yeah. You know, I feel like that flame hot Cheeto does took away from that flavor a little bit. Mm. But um, yeah, they're both a great dishes. I I did 100% eat all of this. But yeah, I felt like this had just a little bit more flavor to it, and then they gave me a whole bunch of different things. You know. What you thinking? Um, well, I was looking at it, I'm like, man, they won. <laughs> <laughs> Just looking at it, I'm like, yeah, they snapped. I mean, they, they had like a lot of different 
different flavors, a lot of complex flavors. Mm -hmm. um, we went with what we think the judge would like, and then we probably need to do a lot more. But I mean, it's only a lesson because this will not be the last cook-off. I can guarantee you that. Yeah. And um, I mean, this this whole experience was. He fun. did say our dessert was better and our chicken was better. He did like a belt, like one of them wrestling mm, belts, and we walk around the house like this. <laughs> All right, you guys. I enjoyed both meals. I want to say congratulations to both teams. Give yourself a round of applause. You guys all did a great job. Uh, it looks like uh, Snoop and Tri want a rematch. Okay. If we do do a rematch, we're bringing in more judges. So stay tuned for that, you guys. Go in the comment section down below. So let us know what you thought looked the most appetizing. But ZCC family always know you got to grind to shine. Let's go! It's showtime, the whole place hopping. Stage rocking is for those who stay watching for when my tape dropping. Long as the 